I've, I'm running out of accolades for Soren Reef. Uh, you know, every week that we cover you and every week that we don't, the numbers pile up. But just take a moment to kind of reflect. You've got one guaranteed game left in your high school career. We don't know what's on the other side of that. What do you and your fellow seniors think about a win like tonight and what that means heading into Thanksgiving? Uh, it means a lot. I mean, we know this is one of the, one of the last games we're ever going to play. And, you know, like you said, only one more game guaranteed. And But, you know, we're fighting to make it to the playoffs, and we feel good about it. We just got to win out and hopefully make it. This new London team has given you guys problems. Uh, they had won three in a row coming in. They had a lot of speed. Uh, but right off the, the bat, you guys seem to have, do a nice job with your tackling. Uh, and then just the typical wear them down offense. You had a lot of carries tonight. Uh, what did you see out there from your team? Uh, all of our guys worked their butts off tonight, especially the O-line. They just they had a nice surge. And we just, you know, it was only five, six yards a, a carry. But it's, it was tough running. But we got the job done and even our receivers blocking downfield they do a great job and our defense came out set the tone and that really that gave us a boost going into the, the second half so you got a couple weeks right thanksgiving's coming up uh what is your message uh, as a leader of this team with your fellow seniors what is your message going to be carrying your team into the thanksgiving day game uh i mean i just kind of we just got to take it one game at a time you know me the extra julius boys and only a couple guys on the team, we've been to the playoffs before, we've been to two state championships, so we just got to kind of guide those guys in the right direction and you know, take it, only take it one game at a time. Just If you do your jobs on Thanksgiving and other teams do theirs, there's a chance that you guys get in. What does opening the season with a Massac, with a Notre Dame, schools like that, what do those games come back to mean if you get in? I mean – we, those are two very good teams to start off with, and we, you know we didn't hang our heads on that. We want to play good teams, and you know we learned from those losses, and that's what that's what really helped us out later on in the season. Games like this, you know, we we learned from our mistakes, and you know because usually ECC teams you don't see great teams like that from across the state, so that I think it helped us. Well, it's no secret. Back in the beginning of the season, we did our fall sports preview. And the question that was thrown to you was, you know, can you win again? Can you do it again? And the answer was, right, you know, I, I hope so. Um, how are you going to approach personally Thanksgiving as your la guaranteed your last regular season game in high school? Yeah, I'm just going to leave it all out in the field. I know me, the extra Julius boys, captains of the team, we got to really set a good example for those, the younger guys. And, you know, we're, I know they're going to give it their all, and I know I'm going to give it my all. And if that is the case, Killingly's got a shot. And as long as he got a shot, never know, Killingly High School is going to be making some noise in the postseason. Soren Reef, our player of the game tonight, big Killingly win here at New London.